guys? Fan of here, welcome to another video. Why of iPhone takes your pictures every five seconds, guys? Well, guys, uh, theoretically everything's a picture. But I was not informed of freaking Claim on TikTok, guys. You can't believe everything on TikTok, guys. You know what I mean? There's gotta be like, you know, that verifiable. Recently, iPhone users have become afraid that the front-facing camera might be taking photos of them. I switched from iPhone, guys. I, I'm Android. I've used iPhone for a little. i used iPhone for a little. It's alright, it's alright. Every five seconds has seen in the... I might get back on the cloud pretty soon. These ...types of videos. But is iPhone actually taking your photo? And if... But nah, that's not cool if iPhone is taking my photo. That is not cool. That's not something we could vouch for, squad. So, why? Well, it's true that the infrared camera activates about every five seconds and shoots out 30,000 invisible dots. This isn't the phone taking- Infrared. So is it like some face ID, like red condition or something good? What is it, guys? Taking a photo, per se, but it is checking to see what's in front of it. It's part of iPhone's True Depth camera system that debuted on iPhone 10, and Apple's been using it for a variety of features. Yeah, I'd be open, opening up my laptop or whatever, and I'd be like, yo, what's this thing on my face, or why does it feel like my face being red? What kind of BS is this? You know what I mean? It's like gaslighting me by watching. I don't know, guys to make iPhone more functional. Initially, it was used to map your face and use it as a biometric authenticator, so that when... So, it was taking pictures of us while we're doing that, guys. If you ever signed up for iPhone. <laughs> when I signed up for iPhone, it took a good minute, but I was there for a good minute. When you unlocked your iPhone or bought an app, you didn't have to enter a passcode or password. Instead, the infrared camera would shoot out those 30,000 dots to map your face and confirm your identity. But why then would Apple continue activating these dots even after you've unlocked your phone? Well, it has to do with something called attention-aware features. You can find it in settings under Face ID and pa Passcode. These always, uh, always a struggle. Always a, a, it's like an assignment when you load up the settings on a new device. We'll never know what we're gonna find, you know. Capabilities utilize the infrared face map while the device is being used in order to do a. All this Apple TV podcast, I never really use that stuff, guys. Variety of things. For example, if you haven't touched your iPhone's display in a few minutes, it'll check to see if you're looking at the display before dimming it to save battery. Before... Oh, you know, when my Android device does something similar, it's super annoying. It's like permanently on. My Pixel 4, I actually had that on for security reasons on my Pixel devices. But saving the pictures, guys, saving the pictures, I don't know about save, uh, saving the pictures, guys. You know what I mean? Or iPhone had no way of knowing where you were looking, and it would dim the display regardless. It also allows iPhone to lower the volume of alerts and alarms once it recognizes that you're looking at the device. Before... Thank goodness. I'm all for that. Or turning down... It gets so annoying. These sounds meant scrambling for the stop or snooze buttons. And when you wake your device, notifications will automatically expand to reveal message previews or calendar event details that would otherwise remain hidden if your face wasn't recognized. Plus, all the mapping data of your face. Oh, didn't catch that part. Plus, all the mapping data of your face is stored locally on iPhone's secure enclave. So no one. That's always good. Not even Apple has access to it. 
No, it's good. But if you'd still prefer to turn this feature I haven't really calculated it, but I mean, everybody in freaking. I say like a good percentage of guys have it, and I don't. Off, you can simply flip the toggle in settings. This is Greg with Apple Explained. Thanks for watching till the end, and I'll see you in the next video. <laughs> well, that's a video, fam. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, press that join button, and I'll see you guys next one, fam. Let's go, let's go.